Welcome to Matt's Profit Pursuit. I'm Matt. I'm a part-time reseller who sells on eBay, and I make what sold videos so you see what's selling right now on eBay and break down each sale so you get a realistic look on how much money is really made after fees, cost of goods, shipping, and taxes are taken out. Got a lot to do today, and I feel like I'm running behind, so let's go through this real quick. Got 13 orders going out. Let's see what sold. Sold a couple hats. Sold this Iron Man Tulsa hat. My second or third Iron Man hat that sold. I paid 30 cents for this hat and it sold for $12.99 plus shipping. The buyer is all in at $20.06 and after fees and shipping, I get $11.62. Sold this Sacramento Kings uh, Zephyr hat. I paid 30 cents for this hat and it sold for $12 plus shipping. The buyer is all in at $17.93. And after fees and shipping, I get $8.73. So this Pendleton women's blazer coat thing. This is a women's vintage wool Pendleton blazer. I paid $1.60 for it and it sold on my half off sale for $16.49 plus shipping. The buyer is all in at $26.48. And after fees and shipping, I get $11.94. Sold this Adidas Climb Up Warm hoodie. I paid $1.80 for this hoodie and it sold for $15 plus shipping. The buyer is all in at $25.50 and after fees and shipping, I get $9.97. I sold this Houston Texans crew neck. It's just the NFL brand. I guess it's actually a slight V-neck. I paid $1.50 for it and it sold for $18.99 plus shipping. And this sold the same day I dropped my Flip the World Stacy Reseller Box unboxing. Go check it out if you haven't seen it. The buyer is all in at $29.65. And after fees and shipping, I get $12.57. Sold this pair of New Balance 696s. I paid $5 for these and I've had them for a while, so I took an offer of $10 plus shipping. The buyer is all in at $24.45, and after fees and shipping, I get $7.61. Sold this coach purse. I paid $1.95 for this purse, and it sold on my half off sale for $17.49 plus shipping. The buyer is all in at $33.48, and after fees and shipping, I get $13.84. Sold this pair of Nikes. These are the Nike Court Legacy Min Size 12. I paid $2.60 for these and they sold on my half off sale for $16 plus shipping. The buyer is all in at $28.52 and after fees and shipping, I get $11.01. So this pair of leather vans. I paid $3.30 for these vans and they sold for $15 plus shipping. The buyer is all in at $27.17, and after fees and shipping, I get $10.17. So this pair of high top chucks. High top Converse are always in demand. They might not sell for high dollar, but they sell pretty quick. I paid $2.20 for these, and they sold within a week for $15 plus shipping. The buyer is all in at $24.84, and after fees and shipping, I get $12.33. So this NASCAR rug. This is a 2002 Dale Earnhardt Jr. number no. eight Budweiser car rug. I paid $1.95 for it and it sold for $22.99 plus shipping. The buyer is all in at $40.92. And after fees and shipping, I get $19.12. So this pair of Oakley snowboarding goggles. I paid 40 cents for these and they sold for $35 plus shipping. The buyer is all in at $43.75 and after fees and shipping, I get $24.06. 40 cents into $24 are the sales I strive for, but they can't all be that good. And I sold this paintball mask with goggles. I paid $2 for this mask with goggles and it sold for $29.99 plus shipping. The buyer is all in at $47.86 and after fees and shipping I get $27.25. Now let's do a breakdown of all the sales and see how much I really made. 
For those items, I have a total of $368.29 in sales. After fees, I'm left with $187.73, minus the cost of goods, which was $24.85. Put 25% for taxes, which is $40.75. Invest 20% back into the business, which is $24.44. And that gives me $97.79 in my pocket. It's about three and a half hours worth of work. So that's an hourly rate of $27.94 after fees and taxes. So that's it for me on this one. Hopefully next time I can actually have a topic to talk about. But until then, God bless. Peace.